Hello, welcome back. My name is Pixelated Twix, and welcome to another episode of The One and Done for my time at Sandrock. The last time we left off, we were given a number of, well, just one major particular, one major particular, one major quest. Um, and so we need to go ahead and do that. We did kind of end off um, there because it was getting late. It was getting late in real life and it was getting late in the game. And so I just want to go ahead and save there. So we're back in the game and hopefully we'll be able to finish uh, this quest line today. I'm hoping I didn't want to make this like a three part series because I don't know. I kind of debating when it comes out if I want to bring this to the channel because I've never really brought a my time at Porsche type game or like Stardew Valley to the channel before because I don't know I just never thought that it would be something that I would want to do because again these are casual games that I like to play on my own and I just want to take my time with them and some people aren't just into that oh cutscene <laughs> She is adorable. Hi, Jasmine. Trudy's daughter, delivery girl. Hi, I'm Jasmine. I was delivering your sample newspaper. If you like reading it, just go to the newsstand near City Hall to just subscribe. Then you will get each issue in the mail. Oh, hey. I bet it's hard moving to a new place. I know this town like the back of my hand. Let me show you around. I'm a super good tour guide. I know lots of stuff about Sand Rock. Okay, I mean... That sounds good. Let's go. Yeah, cool. The Jasmine Co. official Sound Rock Tour, Sand Rock Tour is now beginning. Our first stop will be the Wandering Y Yakmo Ranch. All right. So what is this? Oh, I can track? Oh, that's cool. Okay, so let's track her. Am I tracking her or am I tracking the, I don't know. I didn't say now that I sounds like it looks like I'm tracking the actual oh there's a okay let me not get sidetracked let me follow Jasmine because I don't want to lose her where are we at are we at the Yakmo Ranch passengers please look ahead and notice Mr. Cooper and Mrs. Mabel and Elsie's house they have a really big ranch that means they get built for everyone maybe some other stuff too oh yeah you oh you can see the Yakmo over there I like to say hi to them every day. Sometimes they even say hi back, but it sounds like moo. I think they sell stuff that you could use to take care of the animals here. That might be useful for you, huh? On the next stop, please keep your hand and hands and feet inside the imaginary vehicle. All right. I love her little teddy bear backpack. It is adorable. And look how she runs. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. I love this game so far. I, I know I said this before, but I really do like this game a whole bunch. <laughs> I don't know why I say it a whole bunch, but I guess that's why I like this game. Ta-da! This is Marno's Oasis. Miss Marno was the first mayor of Scene Rock, and she found this oasis a long time ago. We all drink this water, so don't step in it. In the middle, you can, of course, see a statue of Mr. Peach. One day, I hope I can invent something really cool like Peach did. The big water tower over there is where we keep extra water. Mr. Burkett takes care of it, and you can get some from him if you give him some money. Oh, hey, that reminds me. Do you know what the official town slogan is? Minister Matilda came up with it, and now everybody says it all the time. Um, town with Logan. <laughs> Um, probably conserve water. Wow, yeah, that's right. You got it. You must have done your homework. I gave you a sticker, but I don't have any. Conserve water. That's her slogan. If we run out, um, I guess we have to go live somewhere else. So we should say our slogan a lot to help people remember. This concludes the Martles Oasis part of our tour. For our next step, we will be visiting Fabulous City Hall. Okay, I think we went there already, but I won't let Jasmine know that. I'll let her handle the tour. You know, she's a, she's a kid, so we're going to humor her. And she's just adorable. I can't help it. But um, I don't want to 
Let me look around. Okay, I'll just make sure Pan is around because I don't need him jumping. Uh, okay, is he coming? Okay, this is just her. I just want to make sure he's not jumping off the roof again. The first thing you would notice about City Hall is that it's very big. Grown-ups often go into this building and talk a lot. My mom works here when she isn't going out to the desert. Aunt Heidi also works next door. She builds bridges and upgrades houses and stuff. Say, isn't that the same job as you? What's the difference? Oh, by the way, from the station to here is the main street of San Rock. RVL store, Grandma Vivi's clothes shop, Mr. Owen's saloon, um, Mr. Pablo's parlor. Yeah, they're all in the street, so you can definitely go shopping here when you have time. Move you right along. Uh, can we go see Owen? I, I would like to stop at the saloon. You know? It's Miguel. <laughs> Somebody said... <laughs> I think it was Jay that said, you guys have to just stop by Jay. I'm going to link her channel in the description box, but she said that he looks like Michael Jackson, which he does actually look like Michael Jackson. Um, yeah. Okay. Sandy! Oh my gosh. This camel is epic. It's so cute. What is this? For the next stop on our tour, please bring your attention to right over there, where you'll see the beautiful Church of the Light Temple. Most of us come here every Sunday to sing and listen to Minister Matilda tell us not to do bad stuff. My favorite songs are ones about Peach. You should come over next time. And this is the last stop on the tour. If you follow the path to the right, you'll find the Research Center and the Golden Goose. Um, I think that's it. This place is pretty big. You should look around when you have downtime. I will do that. Thank you for the tour. You did a great job. This concludes the very special Jasmine Co. Tour. That's enough walking for today. So what do you think of your new home? I like it. It's very nice here. Yeah, I think so too. A lot of people don't like this place so much, but you do. So I think that means we can be good friends. Anyway, I'm sure you have lots of things to build. As for me, I need to go to Aunt Katori's Game Center for business. Come join me if you get time. That is one young entrepreneur. Gotta like it. Okay, so there's the wanted poster of Logan. What is, this is the church, right? All right, so we've spent a lot of time um, doing this tour. Can I jump down here? Yeah. Um, what's, what's all this here? This is nothing. I just wanna kinda look around a little bit, see if I find any like hidden treasure. Oh, is this another piece of junk? Yeah, this piece of junk. Oh, let's get this here too. Oh, some, there's a bunch of stuff over here. Y'all are litter bugs, for real. It's just throwing your junk everywhere. Or is this the stuff that comes up from the ground? In, um, okay, so let's go back this way, because this is where I think if I rem Ooh, we almost missed this. It's in here. What did I get? Metal coil, old parts. Okay, those are familiar items. Okay, so who is this? Um, uh, Amira? Oh, you must be one of the new builders. Pleasure to meet you. I'm Amira. I have the best selection of pottery and decors in town as a ceramic cake. Mason probably sold everything in his workshop when he moved out, so why don't you take this? It's my welcome gift. Ooh, thank you. A ceramic bottle. Ooh, I like stuff like that. Thank you so much. Very sweet. Okay. So let me check my inventory because I am supposed to, okay, so I need to go to the salvage yard to get scrap. Also, I need to figure out a uh, furnace because I thought I was fixing my furnace when I was actually destroying it. So I don't have a furnace anymore. Um, I don't know if I can use someone else's furnace. I'm just walking. What is this? Oh, okay, clean up. I'm just picking stuff up. What is this? That looks like trash. It is. Now, what is metalworking goods? Is there a furnace here? There's nothing in here that I can afford. So, yeah. Uh, there's Hugo. You know what? We won't talk to everybody. I want to go ahead and try to get this um, quest on the way. So maybe we'll talk to people later. Is this... This is over here. 
Um, what's this? This is part of the railroad. I wonder if I can go down this way. I don't have the time to figure that out yet. So what do I need to chop these out? Okay, I need um, an axe. And can I jump this fence? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. And here's a tumbleweed. So I think I can roll into these. Yup. Oh, wait. What are... Okay, that's... Oh, no, no. Come back. No. I'm totally off track. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Here I said I was going to, like, not get... Oh, okay, got the wood. Get distracted. But I totally did, so... All right. All right. Let's go back up here. No more distractions. Let's get... Let's get serious. <laughs> let's get... Uh, no, I just want to... I... Yeah. I know, but who can pass up materials, okay? Who can pass up materials? It says to collect plant materials, you will need an ax. You can make one at your work table. Okay, so I can do that right away. Did I miss something? No. Okay. So this is where I need to be. Um, is this how I get in? Um, okay, cutscene. You can't go in there. Hey there, builder. Need anything from the Civil Corps? If it's not urgent, I'm supposed to stay right here. Sheriff told me I have to watch this door. Make sure no crazy robots get out of the Paradise Lost Hazard Ruins here behind me. Paradise Lost used to be shopping mall in the old world, but after the day of the calamity, all the robots went crazy. Or was it before? I don't know. I was never good at history. Oh, do you want to go in here? I thought you just wanted to chat with me. Well... The lock on this door here is broken, and Justice told me not to let anyone in or out until it's fixed, so sorry. Okay, I see. I can fix it? Yeah, probably. The door kind of looks fine to me, but I gotta follow orders. Sheriff Justice has to, give, to get, get an official commission through the city hall. That's just how it is, I guess. So until Justice does the paperwork, I'm sorry to say I can't help you. Yeah, maybe you'll get a commission soon to fix it, but who knows how long that could be. If I were you, I'd just do other things for a while. I'm sure we'll reopen Paradise Class when the time is right. I mean, probably. Well, good luck. Hope you're enjoying Sandrock. Okay, that's Unser. Unser. Unser? I don't know. So, we can't go in there. That's probably one of like those ruins like before. Is this... this is an... Oh! Do we need to go in here? I'll just go in anyways. Who knows? We might... Oh, this is Rocky. Hey, Rocky. Dad, nabbit. Every time. It never fails. Something. Okay. Sorry. <sighs> all you surface folk can complain all you want. San Rock is paradise for us salvagers. Paradise found. Anyways, there's plenty of resources under this place for a lifetime. Okay. He's surface? He's not surface? What do you mean, surface folk? Are you not... Who's Bama? Is that his wife? That's his wife. It's not for me. Nobody would ever do any work around here. I caught a minor writing a letter to their family on company time, no less. Can you believe that? Uh, I mean, I understand because it's not like I haven't done anything on company time. Who hasn't done anything on company time that they weren't supposed to? Unless you're like the perfect employee I have. I am here to admit it. So I can see writing a letter. You shouldn't do it. I'm not saying it's right, it's wrong. Okay, so this looks like where I am supposed to dig up stuff. So this stuff? Yeah. Nice little collection of junk. Ooh, data disc. On the shoulders of buried giants. Isn't this a data disc? I should talk to a local researcher about it. Okay. So we have that. To, uh, can I not? Okay. So it's highlighted. So if it's highlighted blue, does it mean I'm actually destroying it? Because this one behind it, behind me? Oh, I guess so. Okay. So that's good. It's kind of like an AOE effect. Gotcha. Nice. And I've an experience. This is a big pile of junk. Level four. So my attack went up, my health points went up. 
Okay, so what is this? This is another junk pile. Yep. I wonder how much I'm actually going to need. Alexis, let me know that we have a... <laughs> Oh my gosh. I can't even say her name without her like chiming in. Is this more junk? Yeah. There's Venti, there's V, five, Fo, Fum. Girl, your stam is almost gone. Uh, maybe we should chill out for today. We can come back and get the rest of this later. I only have so much stamina and I don't know what else that I might need to do. So, okay, so what I need to do is I need to build a crane lift. I need bricks. I need a wooden stick. Oh, five wooden sticks. Um, what is the sand lake? Um, okay, so probably shouldn't even do that now that I think of it. Well, I don't know. Reminder, fireside meeting. Oh, that's right. Forgot about that. Okay, well, let's head over. Um, do I have time to, like, drop some stuff off? Do I even have a storage box? Water tank, interact, adjust. What does that even mean? Inventory, water. Oh, so I have the, like actual water to re I've gotta like fill this up. Okay, well, do I have time to build something? I do need another furnace. I bet you I can't make one. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, no, no. You guys. <gasps> um, I'm not going to be able to make the furnace because I don't, oh wait, unless it's right here. Let's, let's go to the fireside. We only have 30 minutes. I forgot where it was at. Um, I'm not going to be able to make a furnace. Am I going to be able to finish this quest <laughs> or do I make a furnace on the, um, not the not the work table, but the other thing. I don't remember. This is a shortcut. Please say this is a shortcut. I have no idea where I'm going. It's over here. Or is it over here? It's over here. I think. Um Is this right? Oh gosh. Where's it at? Is, is it City Hall or oh man. Where am I? Not where I'm supposed to be. This is why you leave early. I am so turned around right now. Oh gosh, there's Penn. Okay, it looks like everybody's going this direction, so I might be going the right way. Who's Mabel? Hi, I haven't met you yet. Sorry, didn't mean to push. Uh, here we are, let's jump over. Here we go. Okay. Simmer down now, y'all. <clears throat> As many of y'all know, our resident builder Mason, who has been a hardworking member of our community for many years, will be leaving our flock to seek, shall we say, greener pastures. But today's meeting is not about goodbyes. There will be plenty of time for that at Mason's retirement party. Now, today is a celebration of hellos. Let's give it up for our new builders, Mian and Pix. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. Thanks, everyone. Very excited to be starting here. I'm going to do my very best to bring Telesis to Sandrock. What is Telesis? I need to look that up. Pix, care to say a few words? Um, I want to make many friends. I want to live a carefree life. I want to be a great builder. I want all of these things. All these things. I want to make many friends. <laughs> well, I don't expect, didn't expect that one. We've gotten ourselves a companionable soul here. I'm sure you'll find a lot of friends here in Sand Rock. I'd like to find love too. Hi, Owen. Everyone, let's be patient with our new builders while they learn the ropes. And builders, don't hesitate to ask any of us for help. We won't be hesitating it and to put you all to work. Thank you, Commissioner Yan. One more time. Oh, that was Commissioner Yan. 
My bad. Thank you, Commissioner Yant. One more time, a big sand rock welcome for our new builders. Yay! We have some omelets, courtesy of none other than our very own Owen. Ooh, Owen's a cook, y'all. He's a good man. Get them while they're still hot. Meetings adjourned. Oh, and remember, conserved water. All right. Hi, Owen. Hey, you're one of the new builders. Pleasure to meet your acquaintance. I'm Owen. I run the Blue Moon Saloon. I've seen you around. Are you hungry? I've got a couple sample dishes. I know you can work up quite an appetite after spending a day in the ruins. Drop by any time, I'll be around. Oh, I'll drop by. Who's this, Cooper? M Mabel? Burgess? Vivi? Hi. Well, now look at you, a new builder in town. Always glad to see a new face. Hey there now, sugar, take this scarf. It gets chilly here at night, courtesy of Taylor May. Don't be a stranger, you hear? Okay, tailor-made, which is kind of cool, just like a little side note. My mother used to have a, a boutique that you, it was only open when, by like um, request, and she called it tailor-made. Just, you know, it's probably something you didn't care about hearing, but I just thought that was kind of cool. Okay, is this junk? Nope, it's not junk. All right, so it got late really fast, like really fast. I didn't hardly do anything, but I really do need to figure out how to get the, um, should I talk to Cooper? Howdy there, partner. Can't say I recognize you. Afraid I ain't got time for pleasantries at the moment. Speak with Mabel if you have business with the ranch. Okay. Well, I guess what I'm going to have to try to do is figure out the store to steal. I don't know if that's going to happen. I'm hoping that I don't actually need the furnace. But from the sounds of it, I'm going to need the furnace. So let's pray that I can actually make one. I think it would be easy to make just because um, I think if, if it wasn't, they wouldn't allow me to break it. So letter from Ma. Oh, when did I get this? Dear, 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 it's hard to believe only a few days have passed since you left for Sand Rock. Your father and I are already missing you so much. Even when you were small, you were always wandering away from us. Sometimes I would just let you walk and see how far you'd go. But I'd always get nervous before you did. So I guess we should have seen this coming. I'm so proud of you, and I know you're going to do great things at your new job. No one else jumped at the chance to take that. Um... Is that it? Oh, thanks, Mom. Tumbleweed. Get ready to start seeing some fresh and friendly faces around Sand Rock. The search for Sand Rock's builder position has finally been filled. Twice, in fact. Two builders, Mian and Pix, will soon be among us as citizens in our fine and fair collective. Mian is from Talski and considered to be one of the most promising young builders in her community. I'm just as excited to have opportunity to stand to start building for real. She had to say on her pending arrival. Pix is also an up and coming young builder from Highwinds, but could be not could not be reached for comment. Jan of the Commerce Guild has said that he's sorry to see Mason go, but he's excited about the future prospects of what an expanded uh, staff could mean for Sand Rock. In his own words, out with the old and in with the new. Re reporting by Heidi, day two, month, year. Day two, month, year. <laughs> day two, month, two, year one. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yep. Okay. Let's see, from the church. Dear Pix, we have an important announcement at tonight's fireside meeting in front of the hall. Okay, we already did that. So, yeah, apparently I got this mail and didn't check it. I just walked out and didn't check the mail. So, all right, so let's figure out, what is this? Workshops. Okay, so we can destroy this. I just wanted to make sure there was something else that I didn't want to destroy. So can I assemble a furnace? Yes! So I need... Three wood. Oh, so I need to make a stone trough. Okay, so I can make, can I two? I should probably make more than that, just in case. But let's do that. Wait. Okay, I need 
to confirm and I need wood so oh gosh this is gonna be all the wood wait is this a furnace okay so um how much wood do I need how much three okay I just want to make sure three okay okay confirm now what I need two grinding saws and I think I can make two oops craft Oh, my inventory's full? Oh, shoot. Um, what can I dump? So, oh, can I make, can I add? 10 golems, yeah, let's just add. Okay, so now we're good. Okay, so two grinding saws. Can I only make one? Yes, dagnabbit. Wait, do I have... Oh, I've got enough. Okay, let's, let's do this. I don't know. Y'all. Wait a minute. Was I making a recycler? <gasps> no! I. Oh my gosh, it is. So how do I get this back? Retrieval. That's wrong. Okay, I meant to make a s furnace. Oh my gosh, I'm a genius. What do I need? Stone, okay. So, let's see. We need these. I'm such a genius. Okay, so let's do two of those. I don't know how I feel about the new build UI, but it's just probably something I need to get used to. So I need quartz. And I have quartz. Um, I hope that's not quartz that I need. Um, is this quartz? No. Is this quartz? Nope. What is quartz? This is quartz. Okay, uh, so I need six of those. Um, or wait, four? Yeah. Okay, now what? I would need wooden sticks. I don't think I have any wooden sticks. How do I make wooden sticks? Um, this is just plain wood. So, how do I make wooden sticks? Oh, it's 1 o'clock in the morning. I think I have time for a little bit more. Wooden sticks. So, I just need... Let's just make three. Or let's make two. So, I th think I only need two. Yeah, I only need two. Okay. Which means I'm probably going to have to make more or farm more wood. So, let's do that. And... We've got our furnace. Yay! So, a stone receptacle used for smelting those dirty old ores in sweet, sweet bars. Into sweet, sweet bars. Okay, so we're going to set this here. And now we can start assembling the crane lift. And we need bricks. So, bricks are something that we're probably going to have to do here. So I can make eight. Unlike the work table, machines take time to create items. Click here on the right to show all the items that are in line to be made. Oops. Okay. Oh, so I have to add fuel. Let's add one of these. Maybe we should add some of this stuff because this seems like it would be... Oh, yeah, it's more... Okay, so now can I make brick? Stone. So I don't... Uh, out of fuel? Already? Oh, no. I guess I didn't confirm. I don't know what. I was being stupid. So now can I add... Okay, so it's... Okay, so I just need more items to make bricks. Gotcha. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Go to sleep. Confirm that sleep. And then we need to collect some, like we're going to get up early in the morning. You know, I feel like you're starting to feel tired. What? You just woke up. I mean, I know I feel tired when I wake up in the morning, but I'm not much of a morning person. Let's... Oh, hi, Burgess. 
Hello, Neil Builder. It's wonderful to have you here amongst our desert flock. I am Burgess, Chief Safety Inspector of the Sand Rock Chapter of the Church of Light. I mostly patrol the oasis, and if the water level moves even a centimeter, boy, you'd better believe I'll let everyone and their mother know about it. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. As per the minister's instructions, I have come with a gift, water. To be more specific, the most precious gift of all. In San Rock, Martel's Oasis is pretty much our only reliable source of natural water. We also get some water from the other city-states, but it's expensive, so we need to be really careful and smart about how we divvy it out. Might I bring your attention to the humble little fence propped up around the Oasis? It's the town's friendly way of saying, don't take water out of the Oasis all willy-nilly, or cut down the trees for that matter. If you're short on water in your workshop, might I recommend checking the plants around your workshop for fresh morning dew, or just come down to the water tower overlooking the oasis. I'm pretty sure builder machines won't run out, run without water in their water tanks. So I guess that means we'll be seeing a lot of each other in the future. Well, I won't take any more of your time. See you at the water tower, new pal. Hmm. So water is a definitely a high commodity here, and it looks like my water level might be low. So the recycler takes water as well as the furnace, um, and the furnace is idle, so that means the bricks are done. And it looks like I might be low, and I don't, did he give me more water? He did. Okay, so I have more water. Not very much, but enough to, I guess, get what I need to get done. Um, so here's some brick. So I wonder if I have to have all the bricks I need in order to fulfill a portion of this. Let's just see. Yeah. Okay, so I need to make more brick. Gotcha. So that means I need to go and farm more. Uh, I don't know if this was... I'm not sure. I think it was, what's it called? What do I need for brick? Uh, you know what, I don't know. But I know I can't hit these. So the only thing that I can hit are these, um, these things, the gravel. Okay, so we'll just, it's, oh, there's the murderous chicken. Um, oh, there's another one. Look, they got little devil horns. Um, I, ooh, junk. Actually, right now, I just need to focus on the gravel so I can make more brick and stuff. Uh, because I want to try to get this done. And then it says I need copper. Copper stack. Can I get copper right now? Because I don't think I have it. I don't know. What is this? This looks like junk. Oh, I can't. Sandworm. Okay. Let's head back home. Uh, oops. So, I don't know if I have what I need. Can I make? I can make five. So, I just need three. So, that's what I'm going to craft. Okay, now I need, what else do I need? I need wooden stick. I need five. I need thick rope. New recipe. Do I have that? I need a copper stick from recycler. Okay, so the recycler can make copper. Copper scrap, which uh, add fuel. So I need that. Let's just add all the drag confirm and let's go ahead and make copper scrap Ooh. wait uh yeah I'd like recycle careful what yeah I have no idea okay so we'll let that go. It says I only made one though. Can I cancel that? Cancel. Okay. 
let's okay there we go how many did I need I don't remember let's just make them all because I don't know and this I need to make a wooden stick let's go make five just in case and I can't I don't see it four three Ew, I can only make the one mm. okay now can I make Thin thread. Oh gosh. Okay. Wooden stick. Thick rope. I need the new recipe. So I need to go to the Commerce Guild and get this. What is this? Hey there, newcomer. Hope you're settling in all right. I think you'll find that unlike certain conditions you encounter in Sand Rock, the folks around here can be quite welcoming. I'd like to get to know pretty much anybody who plans on living here, and that includes you. Oh, yeah? I'm sure you have all questions, all questions for me as well. I can tell you about all the way we do things around here. Drop by the moon, blue moon, the moon moon, the blue moon saloon. Oof. That is a mouthful. Sometimes for a glass of Yakma milk on the house. Head of the blue moon saloon, Owen. Hi, Owen. Um... I need to go over there anyway, so I need to go to the Commerce Guild and figure out how to get the um, recipe. And I think it's for rope. Wait a minute. Let me look again. So I don't have any rope with me. So it definitely is a recipe, and I don't think I even have it. I have no way of telling that right now. So these are all the new people that I've met. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that since we're right across here. So is this the commerce? Yeah, this is the commerce show. So I bet you my friend Jan has it. Okay, Jan, please have what I need. Jan's not even here. Oh, there he is. Oh, do I have to do something? Oh my gosh, it's, um, it's, it's, uh, oh my gosh, what's his name? Oh, that's not cute. Who the, no, I didn't mean to do that. Darn it. Oh, shoot. Oh, well, I mean, let's talk to Jan. Chat. I meant to have Matilda announce it, but yeah. So, you know, builder productivity dipped 12% upon your arrival. Now, I know you just got here and all, but hopefully you can get those numbers up before the next meeting, eh? Uh, I guess. So, you don't have anything for me? Is there anything that I can grab here? Trauma skill guy. Yeah, that's not it. What's this? Oh. So, feather duster, copper gear, marble brick, copper wire, rubber tube. Thick rope. Okay. Uh, okay, so bye. I just need that. So, I think that's really all I need right now. So, let's just learn this. How do we learn this? Did I learn it already? Because I don't, I don't see it in my, my inventory. Yeah, I must have learned it. Okay, well, I guess we're all good. So now we can go home and make thick rope, hopefully. So I'm trying to actually get this done. I realize that this has gone over an hour total already. But this is a lot of content, honestly, for like a demo. I'm highly surprised um, that I've been able to play this long into the game. So this is pretty hefty and uh, I'm here for it. Okay, so thick rope, here we go. So I just need, I need to go back and see how many I need to have. I think it's one, three, I was wrong. So I do need to make all three. And I guess this actually tells me I can only make one. Okay, so let's just make the one. And I need more plant fiber, which means I need to... I don't know. I think the tumbleweed had plant fiber. I think. And I don't think I can actually... Can I? Yeah, I can't do anything there. I thought I saw...
thought I saw another tumbleweed up here. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't see it. Um, I'm trying to think what else I could gather. It looks like everything else I would have to... Cut down. Then again... Yeah, none of this is giving me plant fiber. I still only have the one. So I'm not even sure what I actually farmed up to get plant fiber. So let me do this. I'm gonna have to make a I'm going to have to make a storage box because I don't have any more room in my, my oh, yep, see my inventory is full. So let me go ahead and try to empty out my storage and then I'm going to have to find out a way to make an X because I believe some of these plants are going to require me to have an X in my inventory to mine up some of this plant fiber. I'll be right back. Welcome back. Okay, so I finally made myself an X and I realized that those little like parcel packages I'd seen, um, you know, hanging around. Those were actually items that I couldn't pick up. So I discovered that because I, my inventory was full. Once again, I had to buy more inventory space. And when I walked past one, it um, dissolved. And basically the item that was in it popped into my inventory. So now I actually have a skill tree here, it looks like. And uh, I don't know, it just said press P. So this looks like some, I don't know if this is a skill tree. It is. Oh, okay. I actually like the way they have rearranged the skill tree. So it looks like we have, um, this is, what, let's go back. Um, so we have gathering, combat, workshop, and social. Um, hmm. Let's look at the workshop real quick. So this is where we can start. We have mass production knowledge, gain 10% more XP from uh, make, making items in the workshop. And then we have max stat increase from furniture. And uh, then we have the uh, learner knowledge, gain 10% more XP when constructing things in the assembly station or on the assembly station and Workshop knowledge, EXP gain from making things on the assembly station increased by 10%. Um, and these are locked. So right now, this sounds very uninteresting. But uh, as you expand, of course, uh, it starts to get a little more interesting. Let's look at what the social looks like. Um, so basic stuff, social butterfly, commission knowledge. Ooh, that might be a good one to get. Um, special activity. The social knowledge experience gain when socializing in, with NPC increased 10%. When you reach friend status with someone in town, you can see them on the map. Okay, so party party knowledge. So there's parties? Huh, okay. So that's interesting. Just to, judging from the trees here let's do the gathering I think I might go with gathering uh, anchor okay this is basically like exp so nothing yet like increased items stamina points let's go ahead and get stamina how many points do I have uh, I don't know let's see okay that's 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 all I have okay so let's head back Let's get out. So the, it was under P. I think. Let me just bring it up again. Yeah. Okay. So I got the um, fiber, plant fiber that I needed. Grab some more. Might as well. And let's see. I needed to make, what did I need to make? And did I get, oh, here's all the bricks. So I think I have all the bricks that I need. Let's do that. Uh-huh. Confirm, confirm. Okay, and then we've got 
let's see. I need to look at this again. I hate doing this because I have to keep coming back. So I need to make a thick rope. So basically, I needed to make two more. So let's craft those two. And what else do I need? Um, copper stick and bearing. So bearing, we know we can make here. I don't know if I have the items to make bearings. Uh, maybe bearing isn't made here. Ooh, I don't see that, y'all. Um, hmm. What is this? Uh, wait a minute. Iron scrap. Steel bar. Did I get any copper bars? I didn't. Oh, that sucks. So is there like a chance I could get it? So I have more copper scraps. So let's do that and see um, quantity recycle. So a high chance of getting copper bars. I didn't get them last time, why? Okay, so that's gonna take a while. And then I'm going to need iron, I think. Um, do Can I make copper bars with copper ore? What does this do? Okay, so I need copper bars. I don't, or, oh wait, so how am I supposed to make the, the bearings? Can I make it here? No. Yeah, I don't know. And I don't think I can make it here. Uh, yeah, I don't. Hmm. Okay, am I supposed to upgrade? I'm so confused right now because, oh, from Recycler. So I do make the uh, the bearings from Recycler, but it doesn't say. Oh, I see. Ooh, metal scrap. I already own six. Can I, how many, can I recycle? Oh, I can't. Okay, so it looks like we have some waiting to do. We're gonna have to play the waiting game. And I don't want to have you guys sit here and wait. I guess I can do some things while I'm waiting. Because I don't really have anything else better to do. So let's go talk to some people really quick. Let's talk to Justice. Actually, I want to go visit Owen. And if you hear any jingling, that's that's Gracie. She's saying hi. Hi, Justice. Mm-hmm. Whenever I make it to the firesides, I go straight for one of Grace's patented sandfish omelets. I like mine extra sandy. That sounds... I don't know. Yeah, Justice. Uh, yeah, no, Katori. Have we met? I feel like I've met her. Yes, I did. Ah, uh, no, I guess I didn't. <laughs> You're a new builder. Nice to meet you. I'm Katori. I think we'll be working together a lot in the future. I thought I did. I'm trying to turn Sand Rock into the jewel of the desert with my Golden Goose Entertainment Extravaganza Complex. <sighs> That's a mouthful. It needs to... It needs better phrasing. It does. Anyway, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, drop by and have some fun. Here are a few tokens to get you started. Uh, yeah. What, 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 did she, what does she own? I don't know. Let's go to the saloon. I've been... Oh, Hugo. I did meet you before. You're the new builder in town, or was it someone else? Ah, that's right. There's two of you. Mian, and you must be Pix, the other one. Well, I'm glad you're here. I'm Hugo, the one and only blacksmith in town. If you need to buy construction materials, upgrade parts for your machines, or obtain top-of-the-line weapons, I'm all you got. But I promise the best. Just check this out. This here is like me, Iron Tough. That's the quality I'm talking about. What did he give me? He gave me copper bars. Sweet. Uh, dude. Okay. Let's calm down, because I may need more. I don't know. Um, but thank you very much. I appreciate it. Uh, there's Burgess. There's Katori. I wonder if she's, I wonder if Owen's dating anybody. I'm so nosy. Let's look around first. <laughs> so it's not just a saloon. It's actually an inn. I've always wanted to build one of these in The Sims. It's like a saloon with an inn at the top, but you can't really use that in The Sims very much. But why am I talking about The Sims? We're playing, um... My time is in rock, but I'm 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 just kind of looking around here. Are any of these interactive? No, it doesn't look like it. But there is a treasure chest, so let's get that. Let's see what we got. 
Beef noodles. Mmm. Okay. Did we check this one? We did. This this furniture looks so much better than it did in the last one. I don't know, just some, it looks more, the textures are much more high res and, well, just the game in general is definitely more high res and details um, are, you know, are much better. So let's check out the register, see what's up here. It's most likely just food. I do notice the shelves are very much bare. Ooh. I thought this was chicken, y'all. I really did. Sugar fried chestnut. Sounds okay, rice. I love rice. Tomato beef brisket. That sounds delicious. Soy sauce. Vinegar. I like soy sauce. Mmm. Fried rice. Tomato scrambled egg. Is that like scrambled egg ketchup? Because I love scrambled eggs. Ketchup on my scrambled eggs. So, um, let's go talk to my future husband. I don't know what this is. Okay. Let's go talk. Is that what I think it is? Oh, green chili pepper. It looked like pork chops. It's like those are green pork chops. Where'd he go? He he left me. Oh, there's entertainment. Where did he go? Owen. He left me, y'all. He left. I didn't get a chance to talk to him. Well, dang. It is kind of late. Oh, there he is. Hey there, builder. Did you get my letter? Why don't we have a chat over some food and drinks? It won't take long. Oh, yes. I'm absolutely free. And I like free food. So there's a plus to that, too. But I'm really going to like the company. He's very polite. I've been meaning to catch up with you since you moved in, but I guess you and me and have been pretty busy with all that's been going on as of late. Huh. As a small token of my appreciation, I'd like to offer you some food and drinks on the house. To a newcomer, Sand Rock can be a bit overwhelming, but lucky for you, this old barkeep has been around for just a hair longer than a Pam Bat's age. Perhaps I can shed some light on any subjects you are still from unfamiliar with. How old are you? I mean, because I look pretty young. How old are you? What would you like to know about? Are you single? Okay, the Civil Corps. Ah, uh, the Civil Corps. Here's, and here are, ah, uh, the Civil Corps here are that thin, dusty line that stands between us and the many threats crawling through Eufula Desert. But they only have two core members here, plus a cat. I'm amazed that they're able to keep up with all the security demand. Of course, Penn from the church helps out as well. He does. Now, the one running the Civil Corps is a man named Justice. He and I go way back. He's one of the toughest guys around Sand Rock these days. But back when we were kids, he was afraid of his own shadow. <laughs> Boy, how times do change. He's a great guy, and his partner, Usur, is also very reliable. If you ever run into trouble, you can surely count on them to help you out. What would you like to know about? Um, the Church of Light. The Church of Light is about preserving the sense of community and getting rid of dangerous age of corruption technology. But the interesting thing about our chapter is that Matilda is extremely lenient when it comes to relics and old tech. Oh, yeah? I'm going to move my mic a little bit. See, that's better. In Sand Rock, we're allowed to hold on to some pretty mean stuff. Sometimes they'll even let relic weapons slide. And it's a good thing, too. Life would be that much harder out here if we didn't have the means to defend ourselves. Our chapter is pretty unique in that way. Although, I heard some chapters near the peripheries take similar stances. The church members are always protect, proactive about helping people in around Sand Rock, especially the old folk and the youngins. They've gotten so organized that, as a matter of fact, they actually help handle a lot of administrative type stuff in town. We'd be up a creek without them. Well, creeks have water, don't they? Yeah, it's not a lot of water around here. What else would you like to know? The people in town. Let's see. Where to begin? We're a small town, so pretty much everyone knows everybody else. There's Vivi the tailor, Heidi the architect and engineer, Cooper, Mabel, and Elsie down at the ranch, Katori and her game center, Dr. Fang and his bird. There's also Arvio and Amira, the sibling duo from Banarok, who moved here not that long ago. Arvio is young, but he runs a general store pretty nicely, all things considered. Amira makes ceramics that are top-notch. I think she's even starting to gain some recognition from people outside of Sandra. You can definitely tell Amira is the older sister. 
She's always the one covering for her brother whenever his youth gets the better of him. What's also amazing is the, uh, that she never lets her skills get into her head. Get to her head. She's very down to earth and er, sorry, I'm talking too much. You like her, don't you? Really, this town is full of nice people. If there's someone you want to get to know better, ask them to hang out. Make time out of your day to go see them. And hey, who doesn't like a nice gift now and again? I'm sure you'll have plenty of friends in no time. What else would you like to know? The dangers around town. Ah, uh, yes. There is an infamous bandit around here named Logan. He used to be a citizen of our town as well. One day he just went crazy and blew up a building. I guess being out here in the desert makes some people lose their minds. Other than that, you have to watch out for some dangerous animals roaming the wilds, like the Gigglers. They're mutated lizards who seem bent on causing us trouble for some reason. Oh, and how can I forget <laughs> the sandstorms? Our mayor is out in the desert right now trying to stop the winds from blowing sand over what little green greenery we have left. You know, it wasn't always like this. A lot of people have left, and I can't really blame them. Sand Rock might not be the best place for everybody, but there are still people who love this town. And we'll all be sticking around for better or worse. What else would you like to know about? Mm, that's all for now. Yep, don't let me talk your ear off. Some things you've just got to experience to understand. Don't worry too much. You'll fit right in. All right. Oh. Today was nice. We got to do this more often. In any case, let me hit you with a couple takeaway dishes for later. Builders can't go hungry, you know. is super sweet he made me dinner and then sent me off with our mommy do I have bags under my eyes do you guys see that why are my eyes so dark what what is y'all am I tired I must be tired that's weird if that's what happens if it gets late and I get like dark circles around my eyes that's interesting um I don't know if that's like the lighting or if that's yeah no look it's weird. Okay, well, anyways, oh, there's somebody I don't know if I met. Seems like there's a lot of people in this town, but um, just the nice to hear the little backstory on everybody. It does sound like Owen has a crush on Katori. Um, I might have to railroad that relationship. <laughs> but in that case, uh, you guys, it has been a long, another long episode, and. This is actually longer than I expected, so we might just roll this into an episode three. Um, but while off camera, I'm going to go ahead and try to get all the uh, materials together for this lift. And then on the next episode, we'll open up with getting this lift together. And I'll definitely have to record that um, soon because, well, the uh, demo time, I think, ends on the 22nd, so we definitely want to get this out, and I want to give you guys my final thoughts on what I think about my time at Sand Rock so far, and you guys probably already know how I feel about the game just from watching me play, so anyways, guys, until next time, I have been Pixelated Twix. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I hope to see you again. If you are not subscribed yet, take the time now to hit that subscribe button. It won't take you but a second. And, of course, hit the notification bell so you'll know every time I upload. Um, I can't promise you that I upload every week, but I do definitely try. And this is a variety channel, so I play all sorts of types of games. And um, I hope that's to your liking. If not, then, you know, hey, stop by anyways. Get to know me a little bit better. All right, guys, I'll check to you later. Ciao.